Uh, I see, Jason, your uh, official visit here at Tennessee. Kind of what did you like and uh, how the weekend go? The uh, weekend went great. I uh, really loved, you know, the coaches, the, the staff, the, you know, just the love that you got when you first get there to, to when you leave. Everything just, just seems so sincere and it's, it seems like a great place. Uh, your relationship with Cody Burns, I know he came and saw you earlier this week. And kind of how's that going? And is he a big reason why Tennessee's kind of in the running right now? Yes, sir. Um, you know, it's he's been recruiting me since, like, beginning of my junior year. And so uh, he's kind of been there through the thick and thin, you know, through injuries and through uh, not. But um, I really thought that uh, I should give him this chance and, and take this visit to Tennessee. And it was it was well worth it. What were some of the things you maybe saw this weekend about Tennessee that you were hoping to see or uh, things that stood out, I guess, about this weekend? Uh, definitely the track facilities. Uh, me being a track and football guy, uh, me wanting to do both track and football at the next level, uh, that's really a big aspect to me, being able to do both and at the collegiate level. So uh, definitely talking to the track coach and, and seeing where, where I would be at with that. Were you able to sit down and kind of talk about you know, this offense in detail this weekend, see some film? And yes, sir. As, as a pass catcher, I mean, that's got to be exciting, right? Yes, sir. Just open space, vertical threats. You know, that's every wide receiver's dream. Tennessee was in your top 10 earlier this year, I yes, know, sir. but I guess didn't make the cut once it got down later. Did you ever come close to visiting here? Or did you I did, um, but before like the whole NCAA with the sanctions and stuff like that, I just wanted to make sure uh, it got cleared before you know I, I headed up here. And once it got cleared, um, Coach Burns hit me up and I was like, yeah, for sure, I want to come up here and visit. So were they on you for a while before this past week? Even? Yes, how, sir. How long have they been talking to you consistently? Um, did they start up at the start of the season or something? Started my junior season. All I'm saying, like, yes, sir. did it never stop after you committed then? Yeah, they uh, they stopped for a little minute, and then when uh, Coach Mullen got fired, that's when they, they really hit me back up. Okay, so it was kind of recent. Yes, sir. reached back out. Yes, sir. And you, were, and you said, hey, I'm interested. Yeah, I'll, I'll, yes, sir. We'll see. So uh, I guess now that you've visited, you know, what does this, what does this do? Obviously, you've got the commitment still. You've talked about wanting to go back to Florida. Yes, sir. The new staff, you know, where, where do things kind of stand now that you've been to Tennessee? Um, it all depends on uh, how my next visit goes. You know, if, if I'm, you know, still in love with Florida, uh, I'm still committed there. So if everything goes great, then uh, I see myself as a Gator. But if not, then I'm going to have to make the best business decision for myself. Tennessee kind of the only other team in the running, or would there be another contender? Uh, there's still Georgia, uh, Texas A&M, but um, Tennessee is definitely, definitely up there. Mm -hmm. Yes, sir. Are you planning on seeing those schools as well or trying to make an effort to see those schools before? Yes, sir. Okay, early signing day? Yes, sir. Awesome. Um, it, it, for like Florida, it's about just kind of giving that new staff a chance, really. Yes, sir. And if they sell you on kind of what they want to do, it's you'll stick with your commitment? Yes, sir. You've been you've been pretty firm to this point, you know. I think even during the coaching change, I saw some comments where you made it sound like you were pretty likely to stick with Florida. Is it going to be tough for anyone to steal you away, or there's some things you kind of need to, to hear from the new staff to feel good about things? Uh, Rez, like the main point uh, is me being able to do both track and football. So you know, if they if they allow me to do both, then you know, I truly think um, I will stay at Florida. But if not, like if I get any you know uncertainty, then I'm gonna have to make the best business decision for myself. Yes, sir. Being, a, being a track guy as well, I know that, that that helps you tremendously on the football field, right? Yes, sir. Yeah, how, how does that help you? Speed, you know, being able to break off defenders and just getting open, scoring touchdowns. And, and how did Coach Burns kind of lay out your opportunity here and just why, why they need a guy like you and all that? Uh, open open place, you know, like this, the, the scheme that they have is it's great for, for players like me, uh, vertical threats. Um, Went through a whole like spreadsheet of you know last season and this season, uh, just comparing the two through when they get here and when uh, the previous staff like how much improvement they've had. So I really thought that was that was good. And, and did this weekend help Tennessee? You, know, you said you know they're kind of yes, right there now. Yeah, yes, sir. How much did this improve your or change your opinion of Tennessee? Um, seeing it? Very much. Yeah. Yes, sir. They measure you in this, this uh, during the visit. What were your height? Yes, sir. Right uh, six two, one eighty five. And you're an early enrollee, right? Yes, sir. You, you change schools to do that, right? Yes, sir. So, so yeah, so you're definitely done on the on the 15th. No yes, matter sir. What. Yeah. No matter what. Yep. Yeah. So uh, it, when next weekend is Florida. It's, it's definitely an official visit. Yes, sir. Right? It's yeah. I get another official visit because of the new coaching right. things. So, so go ahead, take that up. Sunday deal. And, yes, sir. And, but you do, do you think you'll t try to take a visit to Georgia or A&M during the week or? Yeah, I think I'll try to do an unofficial to Georgia. And then A and M, uh, still talking to my parents about it, but uh, see if we can get that get that through too. Okay. Yes, sir. If you were to come off your Florida commit, would this be something you'd announce before, or would it be something you'd probably take all the way up to signing day? 
Uh, I would have to sit down and discuss that with my family, to be honest. Uh, me right now, I probably have no clue.